Hello, welcome to Root of Evil. The Tailor. Thunderstorm noises. This game was donated by DinoVal. Thank you, DinoVal. I, I I was given or given given the CD kit for this in like July, so it's been a while. But as I basically remember in the note saying, "Thanks for the game. I'll get to it in the near future," and that is now. So let's get into Root of Evil, the Tailor. There's also a lot of spiders that are stupidly crawling around, very confused. I don't I don't think spiders usually you know like to crawl around the floor that much. They usually like to hide in the fucking corners. I don't know why, you know, spiders are so obsessed with corners, but ro roaming the floor just doesn't seem very spidery, you know? Click here to open the letter. Why can't I just click the letter? Click! Let's do it. I can't read that. Dear James, I know you're a popular psychic and exorcist. And I'm in need of your help. My name is Kate. Perhaps before going into all my troubles, I shall tell you a bit about myself. Isn't that the same thing? Before going into all my troubles, I shall tell you about myself and my troubles. My parents died when I was very little. Great way to introduce yourself. I lived in an orphanage until I was five, and then I was adopted by a wealthy family. My life had continued peacefully until about a few months ago. Or no, a month ago. When I turned 20, I received a will from the court. Uh, the will contained information about a house that my birth parents left me. They died when I was very little. You already said that, but yeah. Uh, the court ruled that I would receive the house upon turning 20. They died in a tragic way. My mother killed herself and then my father. They were found burned in the basement. My mother had been dealing with psychosis. J just psychosis. Okay, for some time. Yesterday I visited the house when I walked in it gave me a cold and scary feeling. Neighbors say the house is haunted. They say they hear footsteps, laughter, and screaming from that- How the fuck would neighbors hear footsteps in the fucking house on the outside? Fuck off. It's like, oh yeah. You hear a fo the footstep on wooden floor outside of the house? Or your neighbors inside the house hearing it and then they run away. And then you have to wonder why the fuck are my neighbors snooping in my parents' house? I don't know. And what else did they say? Footsteps, laughter, and screaming. Screaming, understandable. Footsteps? What the fuck? Are you smoking? Uh, I don't want to... I don't want my adopted parents to know about this terrible past. What, are they gonna, like, fucking disown you or something because your parents have a haunted house? What? I also really want to find out who, why my birth mother killed herself and my father. What truth lies in this house? I'd be forever grateful if you'd agree to visit the house. I've included the keys inside the letter. I'll compensate you generously. I look forward to hearing from you. Wait, 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 wait. Dear James. So, wait, wait. Wait, this is... Kate. So, Kate... Am I, like, their brother? Or who, who am I as James? They're saying Kate has a haunted house, but Kate says she wants to find and solve the mystery and the truth. But she's telling me to do it? What kind of what kind of pussy and bitch ass is this Kate person? Like, I don't want to solve this mystery! Hey James, can you go to the haunted house instead of me? I really want to solve this mystery, but you gotta go ahead and solve it for me. I'll compensate you though. Wow, okay. Okay there, Kate, you want to solve the mystery, but not badly enough that you want to do it yourself. You want to have some guy named James do it. Okay, I gotcha. We're gonna go solve the mystery. This project was done by only one person, so the game will inevitably have some small errors affecting the game experience. I hope you can emphasize and make suggestions to help me improve the quality of future projects. P products. Will do! I'm good at that. I'm good at nitpicking. Not- I'm not good at so much as finding, like, game-breaking bugs, like if I run in the corner for 30 minutes, I'm gonna run through the game. Oh shit, better report that. I- I- more so it's just, you know, important things. Not to say that isn't important, but you know what I mean. Oh. Okay, for one, the mouse sensitivity is fucking weird. Press tab to see the new note. Now it's 5 p.m. I, I standing. Okay, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll help you already. Proper grammar! I'm standing in the house where was written in letter of customer. Customer? 
So who is James and why why is Kate a customer? At this place occurred a suicide case. I will try to find out why they killed themselves and spooky things are going on in this house. First of all, I'll try to go to the other room in the house. Exclamation mark. Okay, escape. Let's let's brightness is all the way down. Okay. I I don't need it, so I don't I, I don't need it. Let me see. My screen is okay though. Okay. So it looks nice though. It's nice and optimized. I'll give them that for now. You better not be evil. Are you evil? But yeah, the the, the whole letter thing. That, that's so far what I'd tell you to fucking correct and change. The door is locked. <laughs> okay. The door is lock. Okay, guys, watch out. The door is lock. The lock. The door is not a jar. It is lock. Singer. The buttons are lock. Oh, it's slow moving too. Oh, jeez. Okay, we're gonna need the numbers then. Okay. The glass is breaked! Oh, come on, you have to be doing this on purpose. The door is locked. The glass is breaked. It's not break. It's not broken. It's breaked. Can I, can I break it some more? Can I break it some more? Break it? Can, can I broke it some more? It's breaked! I'm gonna enjoy myself thoroughly with the, uh, with the grammatical errors and the typos and the spelling errors and everything. I'm going to enjoy it. Yes! Whoa! Look at that shake! I can't open the door. It's like, that vibration! Would you try to open a door like that? Like that? Like that? Would you? Would you? I wouldn't. I'd probably break the doorknob. And this one's missing a doorknob, or... The door... The door missing handle! I can't, I can't open it. And the I is meant to be capitalized. Like, I have this game on Steam, I am amazed it hasn't been updated. I, I can't go upstairs, really? I mean, it's blockaded, so I guess I just can't. Okay, so I need... I need to find numbers for that thing first, probably. Probably. Because the, the, the glass is braked, the door is locked, this is the entrance, I believe. And... what's this? And this door is just not even touchable. Oh yeah, and this one is... Uh, what is it? I, can't, I just can't open it. The fuck is this? You found a hidden symbol! Oh, that, is that what it is? Okay, well then this one I saw the two before. It's a fucking cart thing. You found a hidden symbol! Is it gonna make it so the ha house gets extra haunted or something? Wait, what? Is it like a light beam in there? Hmm. Okay, so we're finding hidden symbols. Like, there's nowhere I can go in this fucking area. Um, like, I don't have... I, 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 can't, I can't access anywhere. <laughs> I, I hate living next to a highway, folks. Man, if I become if I become a big YouTuber, that's the first thing I'm doing. Getting a new fucking apartment room. It's not near a fucking big, busy fucking road. It's the main the main highway in this fucking town. And cars and motorcycles love to go right by my apartment window. It's not fun. I mean, I, I don't really care, but I mean, for recording purposes, it's unprofessional. So, if I ever become a big YouTuber, I can't wait then to move out into a better place. Um, so I won't have noise issues anymore. Oh, well, oh, here, here's the other one. It's a house with a locked door. Okay, right, anything gonna happen? Like, seriously, that's three. It, it, this isn't a good way to start a game, being like, Oh, investigating the hor haunted house. But first, I gotta stare at symbols written on the walls that then vanish. Just yeah, I mean I I, I I okay. So I guess I'm gonna look for more symbols. 
Uh, just, yeah, more, more symbols. Oh, wait. What is this? Oh, I can look at this painting and it happens to have the code on it. Okay, 8, 8, 18, 90. Okie dokie. That, it's kind of weird, but apparently it, it's right there. 8, 8, 18, 90. Oh, okay. I wonder if there's other hidden symbols, though, because I'm not sure if the hidden symbols are actually part of the game's story now. 18... Wait, what was it again? 1890? There we go! A key! Got a key. Okay, but yeah, I'm gonna look around first a bit more for any other hidden symbols. I'm not sure if they are mandatory or not, but I want, at least want to make sure I probably have them all. I'm not sure if it's just a secret if I find them all, but I, I you know, I just want to make sure. Alright, can I use the key on here? Drag and drop key. Okay, well, we're moving on. There's some kind of fucking crow in here. What? It's gonna be a pain in the ass looking for all the sim. Oh, okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. The door. Oh, the door. Okay, so now I'm forced to find a door handle. Any spooky shit in here? Oh, hello, bird. Hello. What? So how are you still alive? Uh, who's been feeding it? What's that not always too? Is that a fly? Oh, here we go. This. Oh, pig's head. That's that's cool. Looks like I'm missing weights for the scale. Alrighty. And an ugly fish. Cool. Okay, yeah, we're just moving on. What? The fuck is this? Flags? In here, we're missing something. Oh, so we're missing a square piece that would be like a flag or something? I'm guessing it's a puzzle based on like what is removed from these two that makes this or the other way around like like for this you see um, square blue there but the red line going diagonal is covered with a frog but I have no idea where the fuck this then suddenly comes from but, sure, I'll okay. The puzzle for another time, basically. Oh, a broken key, um... It's, it's, we, we zoomed in quite, quite closely. Yes, it is broken. I, I can tell. I don't know what the whole zoom thing is for, but sure. Ah! Yes, another one! Oh, whoops. Another hidden symbol! Woo! No idea what it does, but hey, we gotta find them all. Best Paper Award presented to John Smith. Oh, okay. Alright, well, what's over here? Uh, N. A bust. A book. Uh, painting of birds. And a creepy locked door. This probably will serve a purpose in the future. Probably important. Like being chased and you need to lock it behind you. Alright, so what do I do with this? What? What? Hmm, looks like there's a puzzle! Great! The time! Not really a difficult puzzle, I mean, it's just, you know, it's a match the black line to begin with, and then... I don't know, other shit? I don't, I don't know, man. This, this, this goes here, and, and then this goes here, and then... Whoops. No, wait, where did it go? Or, no, that, that just goes there. That, that's, that's cool. 
And then this... Why, why is the red though? Just blood or something? There we, there we go. And, and then bam. And then bam. Perfect. I, I did it. I, I, apparently not. Okay, what am I doing wrong? Do I need to do it down here? I will start from this piece. Oh! Oh, that's why there is red. Fuck me. Okay. Um. I will start with this piece. Um. Oh, oh okay, sure. Oh, wait, it actually connects to make it red if I get it right. Oh, oh there, there we go. That's why, okay. I was just like dropping it and thinking it would auto-align it after I'm done, but instead you have to... Wiggle it until it turns red, so... Um, just... Eh, okay. Then eh, and then... Eh, and then... Eh, yeah. Come on! The fuck is taking so long? There we go! Married couple committed suicide in the house, only the child. You mean only the child left alive? September 13th, Mr. and Mrs. Smith were found deceased in the basement of their home, having suffered terrible burns. At this time, authorities speculate that Mrs. Smith, who had suffered from psychosis... <sighs> There's so many things I could nitpick about just someone saying psychosis, but yeah. Psychosis and neurosis are, like, are, are, are terminologies. It goes into subcategories of what would be classified... And psychosis is more severe, neurosis is minor, like anxiety and depression. While psychosis is of higher shit, like schizophrenia, if I recall correctly. Uh, there are no additional suspects, as there are no surviving relatives. But, what, what, what about the child? The newborn infant was taken to the lo oh, I'm saying no surviving, but then the child. Sure, okay. Everyone died, no, no one left, but the child. Survivor. Okay. I don't know what the whole point of that was, though. That doesn't... That doesn't help me with any of the puzzles. I, I don't know what to do with that one. And... The crow's squawking. I, I don't know the pattern to this thing. There's, there's no... There's no clues. Unless it's, like, this window. I wouldn't think so. I wouldn't think so. I, I need... I need clues. What's in here? Jump scare. This window could have been a clue, but it's kind of odd. Why there would be a window that's like, you know, um, tinted to the to the room in there? There's an iron board, but I'm sort of trapped in here. Wait, what? Why is this door open all of a sudden? It's just like looking around and shit. Can I save it? I think I should save it. What the fuck is this doing open? Is it because I completed the paper puzzle? Because there's nothing else I can really do in this room. Like, that thing is still unsolved. The thing there over there... Nothing is solved here. The weights... There's so many puzzles in here. Like, three or four of them. I have no idea what to do either. And let's just end it here. Because the, it, it, it's taking too long. And I gotta go work soon. Unfortunately. Also, more car noises. So hopefully you enjoyed... Roots of Evil... The, the Tailor, I, I think is what it's called. I think... But we're going to play, be playing more of this, and I hope you look forward to it. If you are, and you will, please leave a like, comment, hit that subscribe button, become a subscriber, and until the next time... Vroom. Good atmosphere. Danger mines. And a nice area to drop and fall to your death right here for, you know, no railings. Who needs them? I'm sure I'm going to get jump scared around here. Oh, good one. Well, I did, but that wasn't a jump scare. That was just... Being very off guard.